What's up, y'all? What's this is the new Anything Goes podcast. Anything goes. And I do mean anything goes. Yes, sir. I'm one of your hosts. My name is Big Ski. Big Ski, baby. The other host is Dusty Joe. Dusty Joe. And we got house. a special co-host from time to time, my boy Neil Ray, that'll be tapping in Neil with us. Neil Ray. Man, we talking about it all. So welcome to the show, baby. I'm on the block and get hot. hot. Niggas crazy. Niggas crazy. Niggas tripping like Yo, what up, y'all? This your boy, Big Ski. This your boy, Dusty Joe. Your boy, Neil Ray. Man, we got hey, a special bro. guest in the building today. Bro, so, tell them what your name is, just in case they wasn't here last show. A.K.A. Dre Too Savvy, A.K.A. Crazy Cub. What it do? How y'all doing today? A.K.A. AKA, AKA Keenan from Good, um, Good Burger. <laughs> you already covered him. Man. Come on, man. I come in peace. Y'all. Don't hey. get it started, man. Oh, man. You, <laughs> you, you, you probably going to have to go up today, man. Uh, Joe been waiting on you, man. Hey. Joe done got a hit list for you and for shit. Real, man. Oh, man. shit. <laughs> Hey man, hey. Oh, shit. How have y'all weekend been, man? Man, it was a good one, man. You know what? I had a good Saturday. Got to hang out with the DMF family. Yes. Hung yes. out over there, Honcho's wedding reception. Congratulations, Congratulations. to Honcho and his new bride. I had a, I had a, uh, the newlyweds. Had a very good time. Had a good time. Yeah. Celebrated his wedding. Watched that fucking sorry ass fucking fight last night. You don't oh, like to fight, man. Joe? I didn't know who the fuck they were. Okay. Oh, man. <laughs> hey, crazy cut. Did you watch the fight, man? I did. It, was, it, it seemed like they were staged a little bit to me, you feel me? They said man. seventh round, and it just happened to be that way, you feel me? So, it's a lot of propaganda, I think, behind that bullshit. Yeah, right, right. Neil Ray, did you watch the fight, man? Yes, I did. What you think bro, about I, it, bro? I feel the same way, you feel me? Because they too early on trying to get this rematch going and everything, you feel me? They already talking rematch, so... You know, they're going to try to run it oh, back, man, and we're going to see how it goes. Come you know, they, they probably right feel like it in house close, too. You feel me? He should have <laughs> yeah. got dropped, but, yeah. you know, hey. He did take a lot of body shots, though. Yeah. Hey, but the way he punched him in the face, he was looking like, give up, please. Give up, please. <laughs> <laughs> up, please. He said, just quit already. Yeah, man. Hey, man, I happened to watch most of the fight until people got in front of the TV, but fuck it, we was at a party. Fuck it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But I did see the, uh, the shot to the ribs, and he go down, though. I did see that. You know what I'm saying? But I wasn't really interested in the in the uh, fight as much because we was partying. We was at a function. Mm-hmm. Shit was going down. Mm-hmm. It was good to see a lot of our friends and associates at the party. We got a chance to network a little bit. So we will have some artists coming through soon. We will have some live performances coming through soon. So, hey, y'all keep tapping in with us because it's about to go down. We had a chance to yeah. holler at a lot of our friends last yeah, night. Yeah, we got to come back some with some, some live performances. Yeah. It's going to be some new ones that pop in, too. We got some new connects last night, so it's going to be kind of interesting, bro. Yeah, if you get anybody else, if you guys ever want to be on the show, we'll do rap, fucking spoken word. Yeah. You got a comedy set you want to do? Shit, bro. We, we could do it all. You got a whole line. We could do it all. Come on, bro. Man. man, why the hell not? I guess why we can't do it all, man. Fuck it. Come on, bro. See, I, I like to surround my myself with why not people. Why not? Not wise. Okay, well, shit, that's you know, what's up. I'd rather you say, Shh, fuck it, hey, let's go do this. Why not? Yeah, exactly. Not, hey, you want to do this? Why? Why you want to do it? Nah. Okay. Hey, man, I had one of the most peacefulest weekends. Peacefulest is a word, ain't it? <laughs> I don't, yeah. Yeah. If it ain't, we make up your own shit. Peacefulest. Hey, hey, I mean, yeah. man, I, <laughs> I had a chance. You know, <laughs> man, I had a chance this weekend to just fucking Look, relax. We work for LA USD. Don't go there. Oh, Joe, no more work stories, man. No more, man. Anything come up with work, Joe is on it. Joe, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Fuck it, he on it. Hey, but man, we didn't have no kids this weekend, man. This shit was fucking beautiful, bro. I actually slept in. Bro, I don't sleep in. I'm a motherfucker when the sun come up and I peek and see it, it's time to get the fuck up. I can't just sit in bed, bro. Have you ever, have you ever been to the point where you just fucking wake up Saturday morning and you just fucking thank the... The creator, yeah, I'm fucking glad I ain't got to fucking go to work today. Yeah, Man. Joe. That's how I felt yesterday. Joe, I had so much peace, bro. I woke up about 8-something-ish, and I was like, fuck, sun up and shit. I look at the clock, I'm like, I'm not ready to get up. I think I got out of bed at fucking 12 o'clock in the afternoon. 
I, I just said, how the that, fuck hey, did that happen? I was man. just going to say that shit. I was like, man, I fucking woke up, said, rolled matter. right back over, woke up at like noon. <laughs> Bro, I'm like, for me, <laughs> I'm like, how the fuck did that happen, though? Yeah. You know how much shit I done missed? Yeah. In that little bit of time that I chose to stay in the Absolutely bed? Absolutely fucking nothing. Probably nothing, Joe. But I could have had coffee or something, Joe. I, I ain't had nothing. I'm like, what the fuck? Yo. It's 12 o'clock. Hey, man. I'm looking yeah, at Wacky like, are we I'm, going outside today? I'll be up early, so I don't miss these, yeah. these plays. Hey, because I'm, uh, I'm glad we younger, because they sound like the Flintstones. Yeah, yeah, what kind yeah. of shit is <laughs> that? Hey, you just yeah. wait. You gonna have aches and pains oh, that you ain't even know. Man, hey, I ain't gonna lie. I do. I, I got them now, man. No, nah, you too. ain't got shit. Yeah, you can wait. Nigga, like, wait. I was man. hurting so much the other day. I thought I was gonna have to break out my cane so I could walk. I am not bush, and that's a true story. That's bad luck. That's bad luck. Don't bring it out yet. Don't bring it out Shit, yet. the man. way my motherfucking hip was hurting. It's either that or a walker, nigga. I think I'll take the cane. <laughs> just see more. Shit. Yeah, I could put sea moss and everything else on that motherfucker. <laughs> that shit was hurting. I'm I like, think, what the hey, fuck? I, I think sea moss, I think me and freaking Ray need about a gallon of that shit Definitely. for all the fucking overworking we've been doing the past couple I got to take a bath in that shit, shit, nigga, when the hip hurt. I'm like, Soaking shit. that motherfucker. Man, bro. This shit, hey. If, if it'll work with that, I may have to be a true believer and go and find out. Because I'm like, shit, I was fucked up. Man, like, bro. literally. Damn, and then bro. me with my fucking back and my my hip. Mm. You think you think it's just is it is it just from working out? Is it like something like a, a, a this nigga don't work out nothing but his fingers? Yeah, is it from <laughs> this nigga eat like a motherfucker? Is it, is it, I'm saying, do you stretch? Do you make sure you do certain things to to get your hip? He and your stretch. Back in line? What, what, what? He, he got to stretch to get the yeah. plate, and then he fucking ran to work in his face. <laughs> I hurt my back at work. Okay, <laughs> where your work is confident. Why you still? You shouldn't have to do much with your back no more. Nah, dude. Yeah, yeah. yeah we're gonna talk about that later. Gotta yeah, get yeah, 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 yeah. Well, I, I can't talk about that on the air. Yeah. <laughs> No, no work is calm. We just talking about knowledge, everything. Yeah, else. I mean, shit happens, and we we okay, uh, I, I can't, I can't answer that. Let me call my lawyer first. Man, hey, <laughs> that's some real shit. Hey, bro, I was reading this motherfucking story, man, where a motherfucker tried to steal somebody Cadillac converter off of their car in their yard. Oh, it was shit. like three or four people. This shit just happened. Uh, a motherfucker woke up. He heard voices in his driveway. He go outside with a knife. It's like four motherfuckers. Yeah. He stabbed one of them motherfuckers to death. Oh, shit. I'm like, man. shit, nigga, is your life worth that shit? Really, man? Nigga, I'm yeah. not trying to steal your shit off your core, nigga, and get stabbed to fucking death. Yeah, man. Nah, but people wild, bro. dollars split by four people? They that go, ain't enough. That, that ain't, ain't enough. enough. Yeah. Yeah. That ain't enough. And then me, I'm like, it's one motherfucker <laughs> hey. now. I mean, shit. Yeah. But you know they got a couple come... of them. If they done rolled to his And that motherfucker happened in their money. Yeah, it just happened. You feel me? Like, because if y'all niggas just getting that one, like, come on, bro. But, bro. My thing is this. It's four of us here. Yeah. The motherfucker come out the house with a knife and he stabbed one of us to death. What the fuck is the other three doing? Running. I'm gone, And bro. why take four of y'all still Kyle and murder? It don't take two. I wouldn't even be. The yeah, other niggas were in training. Y'all shouldn't do that shit. You feel oh, yeah, because yeah, everybody yeah, got cameras now. Training. The other niggas was in training. Look, yeah, that's like, how you do it. Because, <laughs> like, that's a that's a 10 second, the 10 minute play. Come What's on. going on? Hey, they disgusted. Like, y'all retarded. They disgusted. Like, hey, man, you see how you taking the boats off and shit now? That's what you got to do. Like. Come Nigga, y'all in my driveway still in my shit explaining to these motherfuckers? He, he's he's explaining out, how to remove hey. it. Just get a fucking saws off. Yeah, hey. but yeah. that's why it took so many, though. Man, you know what I'm saying? Whoever the lookout was, he fucked well, up. Well, it's just like a couple of weeks ago, the story we were talking about where the motherfucker was under the car on the passenger side uh -huh. trying to steal the catalytic converter. Bitch jumps in her fucking SUV oh. and runs his ass over. She puts that motherfucker in reverse. Runs his ass over. I would have. I wouldn't have ran him yeah. all the way over. She, she didn't, didn't know. Yeah. She didn't know he was under there. Come on, bro. Because he was crazy, on the passenger bro. side. You would have been like, should. <laughs> <laughs> nah. I would have just rolled back. Man. I'd have rolled back until I got on him like Test a speed bump. Then I'd have got out of the car. <laughs> nigga, I'd have left that bitch right on him, nigga. I'd have oh, got out of the car, nigga. Oh, shit. He said you would have did, uh, did a sugar at times. Hey. <laughs> hey. Nah, see, this is your mother. Hey. Yeah, yeah, you would have got done stabbed him. Nah, nigga, I'd have left the car or the truck right on their ass. I'd have rolled funny. over and left it right on them. And then I'd have got out like, oh, you okay? Nigga, by the time the ambulance come, them legs, gonna, they're going to have to take them bitches off. Oh, they're going to have to take them off, nigga. All circulation gone because the vehicle's still on them. 
<laughs> yeah, they, they, like, <laughs> they had to question you for a little bit. Too. For real, like, okay. I didn't know what it I was. Didn't know, I, didn't, I didn't know. I didn't know what. I didn't you know what to do. I'm gonna move it <laughs> off the motherfucker when I hear him come up the block. Hey. So that motherfucker's on there. You know it's Yo. gonna take him at least about forty five minutes to an hour to pull up. So thirty nine minutes, I'm gonna roll that bitch off. This motherfucker said forty five hey. minutes. Give me straight. Oh, yeah, yeah, is the nigga not going yeah. nowhere though. Man. If this, this motherfucker been on it for about thirty nine minutes. Mm. Nigga, you ain't going nowhere. He gonna die. Listen, mm. He gonna blame it on his hip and say, I didn't even feel it. I just kept going. <laughs> hey, <laughs> thought my hip went out. Hey, That's me, nigga, I don't know <laughs> shit. I'm Come old. On. Come on, I thought I was pushing the brake. <laughs> nigga, hey. I'm gonna play the old card. Nigga, you know when you hit Come when on. you hit a certain age that mine go first. I Come couldn't on. remember. That part. Hey, take yeah. notes, cuz I remember. All you know right. what I'm saying? You know I right. That part, bro. I <laughs> came out here and I had a sandwich and I just backed up. I thought the music was loud and I, oh, I heard man. the bass come on and you know, fuck it. Come on, Go out there and I got a normal stereo playing. They're like, motherfucker, we turned this bitch all the way up and it still sound like somebody said hush. <laughs> I'm like, nigga. I'm like, fuck it, nigga. You shit, stupid. I don't hear nothing. Hey, but a word to the wise, if you steal my shit, make sure I don't bro. get in it, nigga. That's Told your ass. Bro, my other car, somebody got me, bro. Outside my outside my place, bro. You Damn. feel me? Like, I ain't even, I'm so pissed I didn't hear it because I always park, like, you feel me, right by the spot, so. Nigga, I get up in the morning, I'm like, hold up. Like, all, of, all of a sudden, your shit sounded like a doom buggy. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, hey, y'all want to hear something funny? I'm like, funny. oh, no. Nah, like, Listen, on. I was at Orkin, right? And uh, they got hit. 12 cars got hit. And, the, and it was my first time there. I was in training and shit. Yeah. And they was like, uh, you can uh, just basically go home. Uh, we'll give you three hours and just say you did eight. Because uh, we got 12 cars. It's gone. I said, damn, that's like $1,000. Y'all yeah. got the Toyota uh, little truck, little yeah. pickup trucks, you feel okay. me? And they had me drop some of them off to a Riverside to go get the uh, go get the little pipes, you feel me, mm. to put back on. And I was like, damn, y'all got hit for 12000 that fast. It got to be inside. Oh. Job. Like, who y'all just fired? Yeah. Yeah. You feel me? They hopped through the gate, you yeah. feel me, real quick and easy. And that's how you're supposed to do it. But I was like, damn, this are shit you, is serious. People's man. thirsty for them catalytic converters. Yeah, that's they crazy. thirsty. Yeah. As fuck. Uh, yeah it's it crazy. was a lady at our job, nigga. They came in the parking lot, hit her shit, and she saw the motherfuckers driving the fuck off. Yeah. Uh, she even waved at them. Yeah. That, that was a lady, nigga. I don't give a fuck. I'd have jumped in my shit, sounded like she, a doom buggy, she and even, I would have chased them motherfuckers. Yeah. She even oh, stood at the up. crosswalk and let them pass. Yeah, nigga, I would have chased them bitches I wasn't down, there. nigga. Damn. And if I would have caught them, I'd have made them get their ass back up under there and put that bitch back. Man. Nigga, fuck that. You're not going to take my shit and have me run around this bitch sounding like I'm in a goddamn battle tank or some shit. Come nigga, on. fuck that. Nigga, Ray pulled up and I was like, what the fuck? We got tractors coming to this bitch? Come on. Like, hey, it's, it's, pretty, it's pretty bad. You take your bad 65. When I got my straight pipe, that shit was that, like. No, his shit was straight bad, pipe. bro. Yeah. Bad. Yeah. Yeah, you know I mean? I, 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 that's why I sold I my imagine. shit. I'm like, I can't, I can't do this shit no more. I had to get off the phone. I said, I cannot hear you. I'm sorry. And you feel me? I am driving. Uh, yeah, it was hey. bad. Like, what the cool. fuck is that? A lawnmower? Cool. Nigga, just sit next to me. Hey, just cool. text me, nigga, and yeah. let me know where you're going to be. And I'll show We can talk in, in person hey. or something. You know what I'm saying? Cool. Oh, bro. Hey, let me pull over yeah. or something, nigga. Man. That shit was crazy as hell. I'm telling you, bro. They even got the bus yard. Remember, they got the uh, the school district. They yeah. Feel me? Hop the gate. Same thing, bro. That's How it. many buses, bro? It was like, it was over like what fifty? I don't over know. Fifty to sixty. Well, motherfuckers buses, be on some thirsty yeah, yeah, they, shit yeah, though. Yeah, that's it. Crazy. I don't know how the fuck. Real they know, those motherfuckers got caught, right? Oh, they got caught for real. Damn, that's deep. They were trying to sell them, and there was there was, there was they were of no value. Ah. Uh-huh. Hey, so that they a bitch. Got... They done stole some shit that wasn't worth shit. Yeah. Wow. That a bitch. What the wow. fuck catalytic converters off a of fucking diesel? A bus. Yeah. Man, yeah. Or like, what nigga, I, where the fuck did where y'all you get these motherfuckers from? And to show how lazy the school is not to buy new shit. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Because you feel me? Buses stop all the time. Yeah. You got to think about it. Man. All the time. Come on, bro. Yeah, Damn. they spending that on other shit. You know, yeah, they like got other shit in mind, man. Cars, but the batteries are different. You know, from the older models to the new, everything's changing. Just like yeah. some with the electric cars. Come on. Oh, some real shit. Man. Hey, crazy car. Man, you in the building with us, man. You chilling with us, man. What's what's going on with you, man? Shit, ducking and dodging. <laughs> man, you owe somebody something? Nah, it ain't owing. It's just negativity. You know oh, okay. what I mean? Oh, there you hey, go. Hey, no bullshit, people. You feel me? Coming only in time of need. So I'm just trying to stay mm. focused. Okay. Yeah. And we're just dealing with a lot of death and stuff and tragedy. So yeah. I've been getting my spirit, getting my mind right. Hey, well, this is a place you can always come to help get your mind right. That part. I mean, if you need a good laugh, 
Man. Shit, we have a mirror for well, you. Can look well, at that we don't know about getting. Well, I, just, <laughs> I, just, I just look at you. And you, you <laughs> I'm just fucking with you, man. We don't, we don't know about getting your mind right. We hey. might fuck it up a little bit more. <laughs> but you'll leave with a but, 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 you'll, but you'll leave with a different mindset. Man, yeah, you fuck around, come here and be like, "What the fuck just happened?" Man, you know bro, I feel I feel at a comfortable place. And I want to ask you, Joe, how was the the wedding? I'm saying, did you meet any new high knives? Did you meet any new 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 things that that could be of interest for you? Nope. Oh uh, damn! Did you even talk to anybody? Nope. Uh, man, damn. did you talk stuff? <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Joe lives a double life. He's playing. Yeah, he do. Cause last night I saw a different Joe. Oh shit! Not a little drunk. What was he on, man? Uh, nah, I'm just fucking uh, with him. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man! Again, shout out to my boy Hancho and his brand new beautiful bride, man. What's up, sis? Welcome to the family, That's man. That's what's up, man. Hey, Lord. thank y'all for the get down last night. Mm-hmm. It was a dope little event, and we had some fun. Me and wifey got out. We had a good Come little on, time, man. That's man. what's up, right there. You know and and if you guys didn't miss the live, you guys missed the fucking two stooges acting like fools. Yeah. Oh shit! Y'all yeah. was on live with it. Hey, that's what's up. Okay. Man, I gotta man. see some highlights, man. Man, some, some for videos. real. Hey, it, it was cool yeah, though. We had a good little time last okay. night. You know what I'm saying? Hey, shit was super dope. So thank you again for the invite, man. man. Hey, man, I, I want to give a Appreciate shout out to Prince too. Casanova, man. Hey, he got an album release party that's going down tonight, man. The Prince yes, Casanova sir. got something going down. So shout out to you, bro. Hey man, I wish which, you much which success. Which one is it? Is that the, the, the bad and bougie one? I believe it is. I okay. believe it's yes, a, it's the sound for that one. The uh, okay. the the release party for that one. Okay. So okay. I'm I'm excited to hear what's going on with him and shit. Uh, hopefully we can make it out tonight, bro. If we can make it, we there. If we can't, hey, good luck, man. Man, yes sir, bro. Go up. Hey, and also we will have him back in the building to perform real soon too. Oh yeah. Yep. yep. Most definitely. Hopefully by so, hopefully by summer we got a lot of shit going on. Yeah, we do. We do. Time, we do. Yeah, so shit. I want y'all to get ready for this shit. We got brand new shows that'll be coming to the radio station, and I don't know where y'all been, but if y'all ain't been here, hey, we got the radio station, Big Ski Radio, is playing music twenty four seven. You get good music on there. We have shows on there today. We got the podcast that'll be coming on at three o'clock. Also followed by the Dusty Joe Kickback Hour. What time it come on, bro? Fuck, I don't know. Okay, well, <laughs> hey, like for, for Joe, uh, his show actually come on at 5 o'clock, where it's the Dusty Joe catches. Kickback Hour, yes, and then sir. at 7 o'clock, Joe play Latin hip-hop. So, man, y'all stick around. It's going down, man. Tune in to my guy, Joe, making come big on, moves. Man. Hey, man, I wanted to give a shout-out, too, to my boy Turbo Kyle Ramon Lewis, man. He an actor, writer, uh-huh. and assistant director, bro. And uh, y'all can find him on, uh, you know what I'm saying? He has movies out right now that he's been a part of. The Goddess, Monopoly, and rent ride man. Y'all check him out, man. Uh, he been doing this shit, bro. Yeah. Shit, I'm about to fuck around and go. Hey, yeah. where's his movies at? Are they on Amazon, YouTube? Yes, sir. Just type him in. You'll find them, bro, on the okay. internet. All right, I'm looking forward to seeing some new shit. I need to watch some new movies or something, man. some new comedies or something. Hey, hey, crazy. Come on. I was going to say, because tell him to plug me in. Uh, I got to do an audition. Come on, bro. No, you ain't got to do an audition. Just hey. say something funny. Then. No, I'm, hey. hey, I would like to invite you to come and do a, a stand-up. You know oh, improv. Yeah. Hey, oh, okay. that's what's up. Some yeah, real man. shit where niggas so, is booing. Well, I, I, I tell you oh, what, I'm going to bring my, I want to, audience, I, hey. if I bring my hey. wife out, nigga, she will boo the fuck out. Okay, yeah, gonna be some, yeah. I swear to God, nigga, we was at a show, oh, a shit. nigga was up there performing, my wife was like, boo, nigga, boo, <laughs> yeah. get this Yo. nigga off the stage, I'm like, man, you ain't supposed to do this shit, she like, I don't give a fuck, boo, nigga, if she had a tomato, she would have hit the nigga with it, I swear to God, hey. nigga, hey, some of them, they need to hear it, man, you gotta step it up, you said a tomato, nigga, my wife is roof. Nigga, you on, make, you, nigga, when she shire, nigga, she's nice and she's sweet, nigga. When she Coco Loke, nigga, that shit go down, nigga. I married a hood one, nigga. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. characters. Yeah. Personality switch up. It go Come down. On, My wife done been on songs with me and everything. It yeah. go down. But, yeah, I, I'd like to invite you to come in, man, and do a show, man. Do a show. That's that would be dope, I appreciate bro. that. I'll man. come through, bro. You know what I'm saying? We're going to have to set it up. You know what I'm saying? We we let them see what you got, man. Okay. I you love it. I'll definitely I pull up, bro. I definitely want to yeah, see that, you That's something thing. cool. Let me focus on. Come on, man. Write it out, plan it, pitch perfect. Yeah. Come on. So when you think you got whatever set time or however long you want to do the show and shit, reach mm-hmm. out to me, bro, and we're going to bring you in, man. Okay. Let's go. How soon is this project? It's, it depends on you. Okay. When you ready? If you ready tomorrow, goddamn it, we'll have you on next week. Oh, but hey, not next week. Hey, I like to tell y'all in advance that next week we won't have a show. My son is turning 18 uh, Thursday. 
So the whole time he was leading up to this, he was like, Dad, I want a tattoo when I turn 18. I'm like, fuck it. When you turn 18, you can get one. So I took him to the little spot and shit so we can see how much the shit going to cost. This nigga don't know what he want. The whole month he was on the countdown, 20 days. I'm like, nigga, okay, what you getting? The nigga didn't know. So he went on decided what he wants. So next Sunday, we're not going to have a podcast. It's going to be Father and Son Day. We both going to get tattoos. You know what I'm saying? So me and my son, we're going to roll up. We're going to get a tattoo for his 18th birthday. So on that note, we'll be back the following week. Maybe. That's what's up. And y'all welcome to come back because it's going down. And Joe with the maybe shit, we're going to tell Joe to stop that shit. (laughs) Ain't no negativity around here. Either you're going to show up or you ain't. There's no negativity. It is saying you ain't going to come. I didn't say it. Because you're going to come. You said a maybe. (laughs) You said maybe, Joe. That's either. That's a 50 50 shot. Joe for you. That's, that's looking at the glass half empty. Okay. Well, maybe you'll get an ass whooping next week, and maybe you won't. Put that in your glass, <laughs> yes, motherfucker. I think, Put it in your glass and spin the boot, motherfucker. I think Joe 5150, for sure. Man. You told him. No, uh, man. You a Raider fan. No, the numbers ain't correct. You most of you are a little, yo. little crazy, you a little number, smart, a little delusional. The numbers yo. ain't correct. Joe more crazy than anything. <laughs> I know. <laughs> hey, you don't want to fuck around and meet Joe in a dark alley. At 2 o'clock <laughs> on the Wednesday. On the Wednesday. I wouldn't want to meet yo. Joe Perry because half of these stories talking about stabbing people and stealing converters. He was the one that got that one person <laughs> yeah. out of the three that left. Yeah. But I'm just going to wait. How the, fuck you, how the fuck you sit there and watch a nigga get stabbed? Run. They Man, probably did. All they had to do was run around the court till that nigga got tired. Well, you know what? A lot you of stabbed fuck. me once, but you ain't going to stab me to death. It, it, you wasn't getting away. Lately, though. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's what I will do. Broke hip and everything. Nigga, I'm out of there. Nigga, I got wheels. I bet you $20 I can beat you to a hamburger right now, nigga. Nah, Garfield. Hey, nah. <laughs> hey, hey. I'm going to call him Garfield. No, fam. Nah. No. Hey, no. I swear to God, nigga, you put a pet behind us. I'm leaving you. <laughs> hey, I put that on everything, nigga. I'm out. Yo. Nigga, I'm yes. light on my feet, bro. I'm trying to tell you. I'm heavy on my stomach, but oh, I'm light on my feet, bro. nigga. I got wheels, bro. Oh, you are not going to catch like a nigga. A hey, man. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm out. Hey. Funniest part about that whole thing, he said he was going to call you Garfield. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> you seen that little punchline in there? Yeah. Hey. Yeah, uh-huh. you remember that shit when you do your live, nigga? <laughs> hey, <laughs> I'm going to bring my wife right the fuck out. Hey, shit right here, nigga. Uh, uh, <laughs> I come in peace. These jokes, hey. please, don't mean in no type of way. It's going to be funny. Hey. You I'm gonna, crazy. I'm going to tell Not you what's going to happen. Crazy. You're going to find yourself trying to cap at my wife and shit because she's going to be clowning, and y'all going to be bagging on each hey, other. And then I'm going to be looking at Cuzzle, hey, man. Like, she really <laughs> like that. Like, can you help me with some jokes? Hey, like, get I'm going to bring her something else to drink. Go ahead, get it, buddy. For real. Hey, but, hey. But at this point, man, we're a little late with it. I want to, hey, Joe, do we got a video this week, bro? No. You's a goddamn lie, oh, Joe. Man. We got a video coming up from one of my boys, man. Hey, I want y'all to fuck with this, man. This is my boy now. Finesse, measure my success with the commas on the check. 
Measure my success. By showing love and respect. Measure my success when my family's out of debt. Get it how you get it. Working or you flipping. Teaching or you stripping. Gotta keep it pimping. On the road to riches, nigga, go the wrong way. Hating over pussy is not a boss trait. Feeling kinda bossy. Drip with Malone's on. View of the city with a chocolate and a red bone. Pops with a noodle gone. Guess it's cover blown. Just the shit I'm on. Survive right the Caradon. Right here in Boston. Yeah. 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 See, I could pick you up and put you on right here in Boston. Yeah. Where the sun goes shining off the chrome right here in Boston. Yeah. Where these bitches be. Fly in a drone right here in Ball City. See, I could pick you up and put you on right here in Ball City. Out of Inglewood, man. Hey, the album just dropped. So, hey, y'all fuck around and y'all go check in on my boy Nehru, man. The album just dropped. It's dope. Y'all can catch him on Big Ski Radio playing every Thursday. Hey, that's my folks, man. We that go back. Man, yes, sir, man. Go up, bro. That was nice, man, on everything. Yeah, that was super dope, man. Yeah. I can't wait hey, to get back into the studio. Yes, yeah, sir. Yes, sir. He went in. You guys, uh, you guys following these um, playoffs? Man, come on, Lakers. Let's go. Oh, yeah. I'm on the did this thing. On, yeah, John went crazy. I ain't gonna lie, John went crazy, bro. I, I wasn't expecting him to do I'm that. I'm gonna be either, honest man. with you, I ain't following the fucking. Them boys was up thirty the whole game. I ain't following the playoffs, but I am following this fucking huge fight they had last night. Oh the game, yeah, that fucking brawl. Uh, we, oh, at the uh, the Grizzlies Lakers game. Yeah. Yeah. shit happens. We don't ask for it. Don't start no problem. What you man. said about my mama? Come yeah. on. Wonder what was they fighting over though? Like the, been the talking. real reason though. You yeah. know what I'm saying? It, Let's play some dumb shit like what happened to E40. I mean, you can file a nigga into the start of fight, man. But no, this, this one was, shit was heated. No, no, this one was with the fans. We know what this one was over. Same, same, same as everything. Same vibe, you feel me? man. Shut your black ass up! Something. I ain't shutting up. Man. Say it again. Yeah, man, you feel me? Then there it go. You better not. It was the alcohol. <laughs> Come on, man. Yeah. Hey. You can blame it on the alcohol in the event. Like yeah, because that. that was a very aggressive. That was back and forth. That was a 10 piece combo. Yeah. You feel oh, me? Yeah. And a drag. Come on. <laughs> you feel me? So that was personal. Man. What you say about my mama? <laughs> I think, I think, honestly, you know what? I don't, I don't watch sports that much, but I always got to check out the fucking highlights, those fights and shit. Because there's, some... there's so many of them lately. But sometimes that's the best part of it, man. is the fight. To, to think at one time, the only time you could see a fight was in hockey. Uh, hey, man, that's man, what attracted me real, to hockey, yep. though, bro. Man. When I see motherfuckers missing fight. teeth and they out there fighting and then you can go back in. Yep. Mm -hmm. For two minutes, penalty bro, box. Yeah, that was shit. cool. Did y'all watch that uh, NYPD versus the fire department? They had like a hockey Oh, game. them motherfuckers was going at it. But, man, the fire department they was always fucking, been fighting. They was fucking years. them okay, niggas up, though, bro. Right the fire department, bro. They was fucking them niggas up. I think they do that shit every year. Hell yeah. I don't know if it's staged or they just be like, you know what, we're we, we going to take it out at the fucking hockey yeah, game. Bro. Correct. And them police, they, they need some lessons on something, bro, because they was getting their ass with. Correct. <laughs> like, About to go bar fight with the firefighters <laughs> after the shit. Okay. Hey, but you know what? I think I would like that shit, though. I'm one of them officers. To fight with a fire? Uh, fire? Why not? <laughs> or a police it. officer? Fuck it. Or play it. hockey? All of the above. Oh. Uh, Why you maybe maybe that fight because you still may have teeth. It's like the, uh, hockey, they aim right to yeah, knock your teeth right out. Your yeah, teeth, so it, it's something with that. Like, I'm finna hit you in the pocket, nigga. Your dental bill gonna be expensive, bitch. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right. Yo. Nigga, all you eating is soup the next couple of weeks, nigga. <laughs> try to eat a hamburger this with that, nigga. This your fucking jaw, huh? That's hey, funny. try to eat a hamburger, nigga. Nigga, all that shit got C's in it, nigga. Oh, man. Everything you bite, you done put a C in that motherfucker. Yes, <laughs> hey, what's funny is they really think like that because they hate each other. Come yeah. on, bro. Come on. Hey, nigga. I got I got my fault, bro. I got this story, man, about this dude, man, in Pennsylvania, Marty, bro. He ended up jumping from the second floor, like, after stealing some shit and then breaking his pelvis. Is that that fool in mm -hmm. no mall? I, the, the yeah, I believe so, in Pennsylvania. The second floor? Yeah, it was the mall, yep. right? Yep, that mall out there. Was the nigga listening to R. Kelly uh, before he did it? I believe. <laughs> He said he acted like a, you know, he was in the uh, Apple store or whatever. He wanted to purchase two MacBooks or whatever. 
in an iPhone accessory, bro. But uh, I guess he ended up just walking out with some shit. The nigga didn't have no cape or nothing. Cause of, nah. cause of, was he black or was he white? He was, was black. He, he was oh, black, okay. bro. Yeah. He's not a super. That yeah. motherfucker said splat. <laughs> I would have put on. They said he tried to run out the store. And then he tried to. But a, a bystander engaged with him. And... And it was like it's, it was too much pain. Slip and slide and crawl and man. The nigga didn't have no hang glider or nothing. He's just gonna jump. That motherfucker didn't even <laughs> have a jump. parachute. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's crazy. They nigga. said he told the he told the dude trying to intervene like back off or I'll shoot you. <laughs> <laughs> that motherfucker out. shot himself <laughs> off the fucking second floor. <laughs> <laughs> nigga like I'm out this bitch. No, you not. That <laughs> motherfucker literally thought he was in a fucking cartoon. Yeah. <laughs> nigga get up after that one. <laughs> <laughs> hey, no, his legs gonna be. Wrapped up. He, he said, can't, he can't my, even do bro, that no more. He you see taking orders like this. Oh, that God. Mother- God. <laughs> can you imagine trying to lie your way out of it and telling your mom, it wasn't me? Nigga, you jumped you your dumb video. ass over here, nigga. And you on video. They had him like crawling like also awesome, like. Hey. <laughs> crawling on the ground trying to get away. Uh, nigga, where hey, you going to go? Hey, guess what? You would never use the bathroom the same Man. no more. <laughs> Where you gonna crawl to? That motherfucker. Yeah. Can you hey, crawl to? That motherfucker hit the floor like he was um Wiley Coyote. <laughs> <laughs> hey, cuz uh, that's what happened to uh, Stax, aka Slow Cuz. That's what happened to his legs when, oh, he, when, he, when he hopped down. Oh, he shit. just broke his shit. Damn. Oh, that's crazy, bro. Hey, shots fired, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Turbo robo, robo legs, nigga. Oh, oh shit. Oh, that's fucked up. You old rope leg ass, nigga. Damn. I mean, that's fucked up. Bro. There hey. was no beef, but I'm back on your shit, nigga. Oh, hey. shit. Nigga, run over here, nigga. <laughs> everything, <laughs> everything we said related to breaking somebody's legs or running them oh, over. No. Oh, shout shit. Shout out to Joe. <laughs> nigga, fuck it. Nigga, shit. Yo. fucking violent show today, Hey, it? man, why not? Hey, man. I start by crushing a nigga's legs and then we're <laughs> talking about niggas breaking their own shit. Oh, nigga, shit. you never thought that shit was going to happen, did you? Nah. Come on, man. Man, I ain't jumping off shit. Hey. I don't give a fuck. Let me ask you another question. What? What would you do? You guys got, got sisters? No, nah, I'm the only child in school. I got all brothers. Okay, you got This you is my, got my cousin brother, you feel me? What would you do if your fucking sister's going to prison mm-hmm. for robbing a casino? I actually, where the fuck did she put the money? <laughs> sis, I know you put some of it somewhere. Let me protect it for What's you. What's his Definitely. name? Kyrie Leonard's sister. Convicted mm-hmm. of fucking robbing a fucking casino in Temecula. Yo, that's crazy. Right, they say she facing life though, cause they killed somebody. Oh, yeah, man, so, so, old lady. That's so she facing life. Yeah. That's Me myself, wild, bro. like I said, sis, where yeah. you put it at? Yeah, it's a fatal robbery in uh, Temecula Casino. Y'all didn't bury nothing before you got caught. Sheesh. What the fuck happened? Man. This ain't the tax collector. Motherfuckers don't really bury money in their backyard no more. But bro, she got life. She ain't gonna never spend it. I, shit. And if your brother is Kawhi Leonard, why would you have to do that? Obviously, were you, he may were not you be bad with, with you? Do you not fuck with you? Are you yeah. bad with money or are you just the fuck up of the family? It could be it, all of the above. You had to do the extreme. It yeah, could be all exactly. of the above. Because exactly. if, if you think about it, some niggas are selfish too. Correct. Kawhi yeah. might be like, nigga, that's my money. That ain't our money. That's yeah. my money. I work Correct. for it. Bro, and he seemed like he's well mannered with his bread. You feel me? Like, they was talking about what he drive. You feel me? Like, he still drive, like, what, his Tahoe or something like that? So bro, he on some much. humble shit. Yeah, he, he humble shit. He so the nigga, like, I don't fuck hey. off my money, but you think I'm going to give it to you to fuck off? On, he would have gave her 100000 for rehab if really? she had a problem. That and part. everything else could have followed. But she probably place, couldn't bro. have been all right for him if he wasn't. You know what I'm saying? I hate they had his name attached to it. You feel me? It's like, and man, like. They attached And he's already not playing any a robot. Come on, man. Like, so it's kind of tough. But they attached his name to it, bro, so people will go look at the story. Mm. Correct. You know what I'm saying? Because we don't give a fuck about her robbing some shit or whatever she done did and she going. I didn't ever know the But the fact that it's his sister, we're going to be like, oh shit, let me read the article. And it ain't got shit to do with him but his name. Yeah, yeah that's it. Yeah. That's you know what I'm saying? Man, yeah. But that's yeah. a way to get motherfuckers to click. If we say something about Kawhi right now and detach his name to this one, somebody going to click it. You know what I would do if my sister's coming from prison? What? Decline their phone call. I talk to your sister though. <laughs> Go ahead. Have them call you then. Which, which one? I don't care. Either one. Oh, okay. I don't answer no phone calls for prison because that shit is traced and tracked right after. You're not lying, bro. Yeah, so I don't do answer yeah. no phone. Yeah. You- it's a dude that I'll be, yeah, some cat said some shit on the internet the other day. He was like, man, I answer every prison call because that could have been me. I'm like, man, you it on your own with that, you, bro. If you made, <laughs> but you, you got made a cell phone. Hey, hey, hey. 
Exactly. Hey, I remember I had a nigga tell me he need me to send him a TV. Nigga, I'm not finna send you no TV to jail, motherfucker. They got some shit in the waiting room. I mean, in the day room, motherfucker. Take your ass in there and watch TV. Yo. Nigga, you don't, not, you don't need your own personal shit. Yeah, that's deep. It'll pay, yeah, that's, that's, you that's, don't. that's yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Fuck you, think you in the bedroom, then get your bitch I, I ass up and go that, out. Man. Go to the yard, nigga. <laughs> he said, go into the yard. Go to the fucking do something. Hey, fuck up out of here. I mean, the, the oh, times man. I dreamt I went to jail. <laughs> now we're about yeah. to get beat up by the TV. niggas. Y'all ain't gonna buy <laughs> niggas no TVs now, nigga. Y'all them type of niggas. Oh, oh man. Yeah, yeah, nigga, there. press your auntie oh, next year, nigga. They gonna say, what have you got? Big pockets? Hey, I need probably to get have it. to buy a TV hey, for somebody else. I was just saying, the, the phone call probably should have been different. Like, hey, man, they going to take my ass tonight, nigga, if I don't get that TV. Damn. Nigga might have had sympathy. Like, Damn, nigga, you need I me to you. send you some, some clean drawers or something? Because they're going to get shit. Nigga. They bust you, you, you gonna need... I'm still not going to send you the TV, nigga, but I'll send you some drawers, nigga. Oh, shit. I'll send you the spread menu. Uh, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'll put something on your commissary. Hey. Great. You're eighty hundred dollars. A the couple of parts. extra band aids in this motherfucker yep. for you this oh, month. Man. You know what I'm saying, nigga? Run, I don't run know. the deals, nigga. I ain't finna send you the TV, Whoa. nigga. How would you feel, nigga, if you sent a nigga the little black and white joint that had the little handle oh, on it? Man. That's what I was gonna say. The old school thing back in the day. Send that shit to the man. Yeah, that's old, bro. <laughs> hey, hey <laughs> well, you gotta tune in to the panel and shit. Oh uh, man, yeah. I can see a nigga now getting up on the top bunk <laughs> like, fuck this TV. <laughs> yeah. Remember when they? Remember nigga, when they? We bring it back to class. Hold on. Remember when they came? Out, I don't know if you remember. They they came out with the camping TV. Yes. It had the crank on the side. Yes. Oh, man. Crank it up, man. What if yeah. your arm fucked up from jacking off and you can't drink that bitch right, nigga? You ain't, you can't watch that motherfucker. That's I don't just, know, Then you're shit out of luck. I'm just saying, bro. Yeah, those TVs was crazy back in the day. Yeah. Hey, nobody will never, the, the new generation will never see that. Hey, <laughs> man. The TVs can, can, go, oh, and then the, it's this big. Yeah, on, that's what I'm saying. Send the nigga that shit to jail and kids, shit. Be like, nigga, plug this bitch up. Hey, <laughs> kids nowadays don't know the feeling of have to be, having to be the remote control for your parents. Man. Man, get up, go change the TV. Hell yeah, you go outside and shit. They go to the door to call you to fuck in. You thinking you're in trouble? Hey, turn the channel five, motherfucker! All that energy, you you could have turned the channel <laughs> five. Rest well, I man. might want you to hit eleven too while you there, motherfucker. Man. Or stand, hey, stand with the hold up the antenna. Man, <laughs> go get me some water. It's motherfucker. You in there next to the refrigerator, and I gotta come. I'm sweating this shit. I done ran all the way down the block. Like, well, shit. When you get me some, get some for yourself too, man. man. Hey, I'm surprised a lot of parents didn't get stabbed back then. That's so, bro. Funny. You know what I'm saying? Nigga didn't have no guns or nothing. This shit hit a motherfucker with a slingshot or something. Man. Tear nigga ass up. Like you never know. It. Hey, see, see, that's the thing. You never know if the parent got stabbed or whatever. Nobody said shit. Kids was getting. We didn't have technology. Up, so. We didn't have fucking video. I feel like we didn't have respect. phones. Yeah. <laughs> Way back back then. then, yeah, it was and, more and, respect. And, and, and kids that's why I'm so ass glad beat. I grew up in the you time before social these media. These days, the kids right. ain't getting whipped. Half the bro. shit I did, you feel me? I'm glad it ain't these never gonna make <laughs> the internet. Hey, but listen. The way we got beat when we was younger, it made us angry. I mean, <laughs> you feel me? Yeah. So that's why the kids now get away with most shit because they, the anger ain't as suppressed. Fact. You feel me? As us having to get whipped with switches and yeah. beat and chase, hey, you, you got, got angry. Go chase with shoes. You gotta go and pick belt. your switch. Yeah. You feel me? Like you bro. got whooped and you got angry. Bro. Yeah, I'd have whooped your ass some more if I was your mom and hey, daddy. Like, hey, you gonna get this hey, shit? Hey, I'm gonna break your spirit man. today, little nigga. I'm but you gonna got break whooped it. for the coldest things. You got whooped because you didn't eat. You got whipped, what? Man, man, I don't eat. Hey, <laughs> wait, hold on. But did you eat your shit the next time? Man, hey. Man, fuck did that. Hey, that fuck time. that food. I had that shit and spit that shit out right when they didn't look. Say, uh-huh, told you, nigga. Yeah, fuck that. Yeah. Cause. But you act like you ate it. You, hey, that, that ass whooping worked. Because if you fuck around and didn't even try it, that's another ass whooping. So at least, that at was least a, put it in your head. That was an emotional scar. You right. You right. Fuck, it worked. You right. It worked. We can't do our kids and like that cr- now. That part, I don't want to eat that food, Dad. That part, bro. I don't want it. I don't care what you and Mama say. I can't run track. Well, I'm, I'm gonna tell Coach what you said. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> All right. if, we, if we out in public. You get away with that shit. Yeah. If we're at home, man. I'm going to knock your ass no, off. You don't eat this shit or no, you ain't wait, eating shit. Wait a minute. When you're, in, home, when you're in public, you're going to get away with it until you get to the fucking car. Man, hey, man. Yeah, especially I, these days, bro. You can't hit no kid in public. let my kid piss me off and they like, well, yeah. I'm not going to eat that. I'm just going to No, you yeah. ain't eating shit. No. Give me all that shit. I'm going to take the whole plate, put it in the refrigerator. Fuck it. You hey, eat this tomorrow. And then, matter of fact, well, you had to give me your cell phone, give me all your other shit. So too. you don't eat, plus you don't get your shit? Yes. 
Joe, That's I'm not tough, that bro. type of parent. I'm <laughs> not going to take my kid's cell phone. I'm not going to take their electronic. I'm not going to do none of that shit. Mm-hmm. I'm going to call the place and ask them to suspend that shit for a couple of days. <laughs> <laughs> and they ain't going to want them motherfuckers. Hey, you and here so fuck them shit. Yeah, that's funny. <laughs> I did that to Rachel one time. Oh, man. Right. What's wrong with my phone? I don't know. I don't know where it is. The bill's not paid. Yeah, I did it to Chris one time fucking around. Yeah, I'm like, shit, I, I turned off. I turned off his service. What did you do? Man. What did he do? Man, I was just being a dick. Mm. And I turned it off. Oh, shit. Damn, bro. Hey, fuck it. I mean, I'm that type. I, I'll do some shit like that, though. Man. Nigga, fuck all that taking it back from my kids. No, keep it. Matter of fact, you want a new one? Nigga, and don't have that bitch cut on. I don't give a fuck. I'm walking around that motherfucker playing games. and they, Matter of fact, I'm playing the games that they play. Hey, I don't even like this shit, but I'm playing it just to fuck And you can hear it all loud, huh? That's petty. I, I'll do some shit like that, my son. See, I told you we could have been playing this shit together. Yeah, hey, man, how you, how you hey, jump? Come on. What, what you supposed to do to jump? How you shoot or whatever? I'm fucking with them. Hey. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, they ain't playing shit, but I'm playing it. I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing. Come on, bro. Man, I'm dying every other second and shit. They're like, well, you got to do this. Oh, man, I wish you could show me. You know what I'm saying? Fuck it. You know what's the best part? When you can get on their account and fuck with their shit. Hey, have you ever got on there and deleted some of their shit? Yeah, some of the little games from Create Mo Space type Um, shit. Because Fortnite, you always got to spend money. Like, where the fuck is it going? You feel me? Roblox are $500 for these two games. Where the fuck is it going? What are you doing? What are you looking at? What do you subscribe to? My my daughters (laughs) watch my show, so I'm going to say... No, I have never deleted oh, okay. any right of their on, games right off of PlayStation right Network. It's crazy, right bro. <laughs> Even YouTube, like, I'll be just on the videos, you feel me? Like, you know, we give her a time limit and all that. You know Correct. What I'm saying? But the YouTube and shit, man, pay attention to some of these videos, bro. It'll be like some weird shit. Yeah, they might yeah. fuck around and click on us on mistake. Man. You don't know what the fuck you're going to get. Yeah. Crazy cut in the building, you don't know what the fuck we going to get. Come on, man. You looking like a big turtle. Yeah. Hey. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> bro. Ninja shit. Turtle. Yo. <laughs> <laughs> Donatello, Raphael. I missed y'all, man, last week. You feel me? I was going through the shit. You feel me? Come on, both of y'all got the balls. King Cooper and shit. Come on, that joke's over my head. I'm talking about you right now. You got hair, but when that shit recedes, see me then. I'm already. It's still happening. I'm 32. It's not going to happen. My line is permanent. Shout out AD. Mine is permanent because of. Sooner or later, your hairline is going to meet your ears and shit. Your she gonna go across here. I think it's gonna be time to get rid of it. I got you, young Jesus. Hey, well, I saw a nigga the other day on a court show. This nigga, he had like a little piece of hair right here, a ball spot that oh, had some more bro. hair in the back. Like, nigga, you ain't you court well with your shit get, like yeah, that. Nah. I get like that, bro. I'm, I'm going to let it go. Hey, Because uh, what you going to do with your beard, man? Rick Ross, what, hey, what we a, doing with it, man? We letting it grow? We just keeping it that yeah, length? It's, it's hey, the chicks it, love that shit, man. It's they do. Gonna keep it length. I ain't going to do nothing with hey, right. it. Hey, Ray. I, I took it down before, but then you feel me? I'm like, nah, I'm just, I'm going to roll with it. Hey, let's see Ray Ray hairline right now. Everybody can grow that shit, bro. Why clean right now? Oh, yeah, you got to take the hat off, man. Show the disc, because we outside, man. Show the disc, man. Yeah, nigga, look, man. It's going to turn into a lake. Come on, I'm swimming in that motherfucker. Hey, it's going to turn into a lake, then it's going to turn into a pond. You're going to have some missing pieces in that bitch. Lord, rebuke man. all this shit that he's saying. No, it's Sorry for saying shit. It's coming. I'm wishing man. the hair Cause, gods. Because hey, I tell him, listen, the, hair, the hairline is there, Nigga, man. I'm wishing man. the hair gods will come down and spite thee. <laughs> hey, hey, this ain't even a combo for Joe. He ain't even saying much. How long your shit been going? <laughs> After so long, you don't remember no I, more. I actually, nigga. it just I, happens. I actually just shaved it. I got um. Nah, Joe can grow shit. Joe, I, he, I, he said he. I can. um <laughs> recently got um diagnosed with alopecia. Gotcha. Well, uh, enlighten me a little bit. Um, uh, where my hair follicles are damaged. Oh. The so shit I, Jada Pika says yeah, she got, and so, it, it caused Chris Rock to get slapped the fuck out on. So I get ball spots. Oh, okay. Okay, got you, got you. Yeah. So, so I only. I get those too in my mind. Yeah. You've been a lot of miss areas everywhere. I'm crazy. It's miss gonna areas happen. everywhere. What's going to happen? Nigga, me and the, me and the hair guys can talk. Nigga, you going to get you a sunroof by... Uh, <laughs> four, four to seven, nigga. You don't have you a sunroof, nigga. I'm like, that go my nigga right there. <laughs> Yo. Oh, hey, that's right, cold. Nigga. It's coming, man. Me and the guys done talk. Hey, it's nah, coming. come on. Wish me you and wish me so. Let's go. Nigga, I wish your head to go. <laughs> hey, we out here. We out. I'm going to tell you, I'm going to keep it 100. My shit don't grow right, but hey, what I like is it take me a lot less to get ready than it will you. Man. You can go hit a barbershop, get your shit together, nigga. I done got everything together and I'm out. Correct. I'm already at the function while you still trying to look nice. 
You're right. You're right. Just the rest. And, like, and honestly, five minutes versus I, one I, minute. I don't have that type of money, that ridiculous amount of money to go get a fucking oh, no. shave nowadays. You talking about Jalen Rose. He on that $100 cut. I ain't, you know what I'm saying? I'll be tipping my barber, though. You feel me? Because he do oh, his yeah, thing. Oh, yeah. Before I used to do it. Before 30, he, shit, I used to pay what? Me, like, but, you know, I'll be pulling up with 40 like, 20 right, bucks man, you for me? a shave? But he really charged like 25 for everybody. You feel me? 25 and up, sir. So. We grandfathered in at $25, $30. Same price That's as an eighth. <laughs> I ain't paying no more than that. You feel me? He charged 25 but I just be showing love. You feel me? Because he always show love. I can hit him up like, y'all, I need that. He be like, man, pull up. And that's good to have a barber like that. You know what I'm saying? Somebody that can hook you up at all times and have you right. But when you lose your hair, you ain't going to need nothing. (laughs) Correct. Just Vaseline. Let your soul shine. Okay. You fucker put Vaseline on your shit if you want to walk your ass outside. He's like, hey, why do I smell bacon? Man, you cooking, man. Yes. You done put, you done put grease on Oh, I'm cooking. I'm in. black like I'm bacon. You better just rub some lotion or some shit on your shit and then hope that shit just soak in. You fucker and put some grease on that bitch if you want to. Man. Nigga, you gonna get home, dust and everything else gonna be stuck to your motherfucking head. Oh, <laughs> you funny. I'm it. just saying, that's though, nigga. Real. That's some shit a nigga don't think about. That's fact. Nigga, I ain't got no hair. I know the deal. But you, of course, you be like, hey, not only that, nigga, if your shit went bald right now, your shit would be light as a motherfucker up under there. You'll have a two-tone head. Oh, God, I already got a two-tone face. Nigga, and I'm going to be right there like, hey, remember, this up, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Yo, that's hilarious. Hey, I'm, I'm glad y'all got the jokes today. You feel me? Y'all wasn't doing this last time. Y'all scared to joke. What's uh, up? We didn't have. Y'all got to get comfortable. Uh, nah, we didn't have night. Night. I was like, hey, cuz, oh man, they they ain't joking. They, uh, they, they don't want to joke. They scared. Uh, Talk uh, they shit. Can uh, I go out? They nah, go we, didn't, we didn't want to scare you the first time. Oh yeah, you already know, man. Yeah. You guys are nice. Red had already <laughs> told me a nigga pulled something out on you. Shit, so I said, okay, I won't do that on. You. I said the nigga never come back. You know what I'm uh, oh, every day. <laughs> Actually, we had to wait for the bigger knife to come in. Oh yeah. shit! The uh, right speaking on that, we're gonna plead the fifth <laughs> lap. But uh, what was poor was a uh, fucking bullshit, bullshit hey. attitude and temperaments <laughs> and shit like that. You feel me? And drama. But other than that, it's all good. Hey, love. Like, you want some of that too? You know what I saying? bought bad ganja too. You feel me? That's what was uh, out. <laughs> man. Hey. Hey, I when it, it when it comes to pulling bullshit, nigga, we do that on the regular. Come on, man. Come but on. now you see. Correct. Come on. You know what I'm saying? You get sometimes you gotta pull up more than once to get the full effect. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. Hey, but Come at on. this point in time, man, I wanna tell y'all, we got the podcast coming on on Big Ski Radio at three o'clock, followed by the Dusty Joe Kickback no. Hour at five, no. and followed by the Latin Hip Hop at seven. So y'all wanna keep it locked right here on Big Ski Radio, man. We doing a lot of things and we having fun with it. We got crazy cut in the building. Man, yes sir. Make you sure y'all know. tune in, man. You feel me? Big Ski doing big things. Crazy Joe over here, Cuzzo. Big shout outs to them having me here too as a guest. Nothing but love over here. Hey, man, on, tell man. them some of your social media sites so they can figure out how to uh, go find you, bro. Uh, Dre Too Savvy um, on my Instagram. Uh, you put it in Crazy Cuz on YouTube. Unsubscribe, you feel me? Help me get there to the top. You feel me? Then story time. Storytelling yes, with Dre. Crazy Cuz, you feel me? It's definitely a whole avenue of different lanes perspective as men businesses as uh inspirational leaders and trying to just improve the next generation you You said story time yeah you feel me come on story time get it all man that goes goes around you feel me it could be any type of story that we all say i just call it story time so everybody don't call it is he always capping with story time with what he tells or is it always something behind every meaning okay 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 Okay, also, man, tell them a little bit about what you do again for the ones that didn't catch the first one, and also tell them what you're selling as well, too, bro. Okay, so what I do, I sell solar, I sell dogs, um, I'm a dog breeder, um, I have sea moss, I do that um, type of herbalistic type things, and CBD, and uh, pretty much I do c- content on side, video create, just do comedy, entertainment type shit, make people laugh, talk shit, you feel me? We gonna see. But still be humble. We gonna see. Come on, come on man. I'm gonna bring you, my you, wife in with a crate of tomatoes, like, baby, like that motherfucker, decorate the wall if you want to. Hey, come I'm on. gonna have a... Uh, uh, fucking 20 people in there paid to laugh. Come on. <laughs> man, we're going we to make something happen, man. Let's go. We'll just, hey. we'll just make sure everything's muted except his his mic. Uh, <laughs> we don't need a mic. Fuck it. <laughs> hey, man, at this time, man, y'all want to do the gripe of the week, man? Y'all got any gripes of the week, bro? Anything happen to y'all this week? Uh, I got another story for y'all, man. Well, I want to see how y'all feel about this, actually. This dude, uh, you know, Riley, the one that fought Tank uh, uh-huh. before this fight. You know what I'm saying? He's saying he felt like he was his best opponent. You know what I'm saying? He feel like, you know The guy I mean? that previously fought him. Yeah. 
He was, but he still got dropped too with a quick hook. So it's like everybody do good to the seventh eighth round in that quick yeah. hook. You yeah, get you, you get caught and hey, lights out. Come on, man. He and said, everybody was like, man, I was winning. He said they gonna run it back. Like I'm like, oh, if that fight happened, I would I would want to see that when he more his back. I mean, you know what I'm saying? His fight was more interesting. Same. I think you the know? result would be the same. You think I, so? After this point, yeah, I don't think nobody really fucking with Javante. Yeah. I went for for uh, what's his name, Ryan went Garcia. Ryan, yeah. Took all the heat by the black folks. Yeah, but why are you picking him? Because I think he technical and shit and do this. And I think he was he was uh, punching with the strength of God. You yeah. feel me? Because uh, he was just always talking on like some Christian. Well, he he might have pissed God off when he went yeah. down. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I'm gonna strike you with yeah. the life because your bad lifestyle living. Yeah, so, that yeah. could have happened. Yeah. And once he got punched in the face, and then he was looking at him. He was like, "Oh my God, <laughs> that shit really hurt." Bro, yeah. he was <laughs> laughing at him. <laughs> that shit really hurt. Damn. Dog, he was laughing at him the whole fight. He was fainting at him, like laughing in his face, bro. You doing that? You know what he I'm was saying? getting up to a little bit. He was popping up, up top of his head, but he got braids, so yeah. it don't really but, matter. But you yeah. laughing, you fuck with a nigga to fuck with their head, yeah, correct? Because yeah. you can get a nigga off his game and shit, and he'll get to going wild, forget the technique, and now he Man. just want to knock your now head you just off. Pissed off. Messy. That yeah. was just too you easy for him. That was an easy bag for him, bro. Like yeah. he knew it too. All right, he yeah. even that uh that knockout that he had, he fainted low, like he laughed before that, like. Yeah. Fainted and just popped that nigga, bro. Like, I'm like, yo, come on. Yeah, yeah, but he got that? mad. He hey, got mad yeah. and he was swinging different than what he was doing. You yeah. know what I mean? So once he got mad and then was egged on, yeah. yes, he was leaving himself open. Man. Comedy <laughs> stops now, nigga. Ain't no be no more laughing. Uh -huh. I mean, hey, shit happens. But that bro. liver punch was it. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, that shit happened. Well, that's the earlier. I go, how would you feel if you had your fucking liver shot out your asshole? It takes you probably just shit on yourself too. It takes Yo. ten seconds for everything to cramp up and yeah, not man. be the same. Hey, that's man. a fucking delayed pain too. Man. Hey, man. If y'all know what that is, it's like a fucking cramp. You mm -hmm. feel me? Yeah, uh, yeah that shit. Like I just that. had a fucked Charlie up thought, man. What if you had the wrong food and then you got to fight and in the middle of the fight you got to take a shit? You can't, you can't fuck around and tell you, hey, hold on. And then you get hit in the gut, and then you shit on yourself. Yo. That's like embarrassing. I don't know. I wonder if it happened yet. I'm, I'm Have you been crazy. in that situation or close to it? crazy, yo. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I'm, I'm pretty sure they give them a certain amount of hours not to eat. Man. Joe, some medicine don't kick the fuck in until it's kicked the fuck in. Correct. Man. Nigga, I had an uncle, nigga, that was down there on a high-speed chase because he had to make it to a toilet, nigga. That nigga jumped out the car running. Nigga, they probably, they called, like, motherfucker, they couldn't, this nigga done jumped out, he high speed chased the nigga jump out running. Nigga, they down there surround this motherfucker, he in there taking a shit. You know what I'm saying? The nigga had yeah. to. Hey, <laughs> nigga. hey, what would you do in that situation? Now, I'm gonna tell you, nigga, I was in Vegas in the situation. That was yeah. a homie. We that was so fucking like a, delayed hilarity and shit. Hey, bro, me and the homie, we drinking like a motherfucker and shit. We drinking uh, cognac and shit. We, we chilling. We, we drinking. And then uh, we wind up eating. Nigga had a little dessert and I had some ice cream. Nigga, that shit with that liquor didn't mix. Nigga, so we dropped them off. And I'm telling wifey, my motherfucking stomach tripping. She was like, uh, you want to try to double back and see if we can go in their house? And I'm like, nah, I'm cool. I'm trying to make it back to the room. Nigga, we driving. Nigga, the, the, something happened, and nigga, I had to pull into a, a drive, a, a gas station, nigga. I jump out the car, nigga, but the car's still running. <laughs> nigga, I gotta go. Nigga, wifey, like, this nigga didn't close the door. He didn't do nothing. You in the car. <laughs> I put the motherfucking park. Wait, who was you, driving? I was. And the car was still rolling? No, I jumped out. Oh. I left it running and shit, but I jumped out the motherfucker. And, uh, I left the door open there. I'm trying to get to the bathroom. I'm like, hey, wait. They like back there, nigga. I go in that motherfucker. I'm like, oh, my God. Nigga, I'm in that bitch. As soon as I come out white, bro, I go to the... Nah, you don't want to do that. You, fucking had you ain't got no matches or no issues. You, you had the shakes and the you sweats and everything, yo. huh? Yeah, she like, oh my God, what bitch? Put I warned you. Yeah, I, I'm gone. Hey, I'm I don't bad. know you. You don't know hey. me. I'm gone. Man. But nigga, the shit, hey, it goes bad when you got to go. I'm just man. saying. Hey, listen, That's true. I'm, I'm never, this never been told before. I had one story like that, you feel me? I was yeah. drinking at 1, 2 a.m., yeah. and then it was, uh, I had to go to work, you feel me, do some shit for four hours. So it's from 6 to, like, 10 a.m., you feel me? So I was drinking coffee. Mm -hmm. And, you know, coffee and alcohol don't mix, you feel me? So I was, like, telling the boss, uh, I'm going to be a little late, you feel uh -huh. me? And I couldn't really go nowhere because I was looking at my phone, like, where's the gas station, where McDonald's at? Me? So I had a smoky moment. You feel me? I pulled over by the by the dentist's office. You feel me? Park my car and shit behind my car. Oh, you feel me? Then look, like... look, for, look, look for the paper in, in the car. Like I ain't got no newspaper or anything. What, what can I use? I had to use a shirt. I was just finna say, nigga, you take one of them motherfucking yeah, shirts yeah, off, yeah, nigga. Yeah, one of the shirts. You feel me? Now I had to squat and 
shit and I hate to tell the story, but I had to keep it real because you told your shit. story. Come on, yeah, man. you feel me? So I parked my own shit. I didn't have nobody next to me recording hey. me laughing at my girl. <laughs> hey, hey, hold on. Hey, what happened if somebody would have pulled up, though? I would have got a ticket. I, 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 the police would have definitely said, pull your pants up, sir. Give you a minute. Yeah, shit ass, yeah. shit draws. Well, yeah. you know what? Hey, got a but the good part is, you were like, hey, can I, can I have your sock? <laughs> nigga, the cop. What happened if you would have went through your shirt and you still wiping the still shit? Nigga, you may have to go to your sock. Man. Nigga, you showed up with one sock? Listen, off the ride. I didn't think that far. I'm going to tell you, if you got to use one sock, far for me. if you got to use one sock, you might as well use the other one too and just leave that motherfucker at the scene like, fuck it. That's the fuck you going to do. Now your sock drawer ain't the same. Hey, man. man. That's funny. Missing one of them joints, man. One thing they say, you can't control shit. No, <laughs> your shit got to go. Shit hey. got to go. That man. shit flows. Hey, it's all shit roll down here. Hey, it's all fucked up. Come but on, but when you gotta go, you motherfucking gotta go. Come on, bro. Hey, and before we go, we got a high five. Hey, man, y'all got any gripes of the week, bro? Anything fuck with y'all this week? My gripe of the week is why is the laziest motherfuckers the biggest complainers? Hey, mm. that always happens. Lazy motherfuckers don't want to work. Complacency. Yeah. Man. Hey, shit happens. That's Crazy about it. Car? You got anything? Uh, nah, keep living, keep dipping, keep having fresh lineups, keep, keep having your hair. I'm telling you, your shit only gonna have with <laughs> 10 years Yo, max, nigga, you gonna have a sunroof in that bitch. <laughs> nigga, the, ain't no more kids getting I'm, sick off your shit. I'm nigga. Yep. that motherfucker looking like black tight digs, ball sweat. <laughs> oh, hey, shit. Hey, that nigga gonna be sex on vitamin D. You gonna be trying Yo. to cut all that shit down to make sure it blend the fuck in, nigga. You gonna still be wearing do rags and shit. Nigga, ain't no nah, way. Ain't, hey, uh, ain't no more do rags. Nah, I'm gonna be sweating by then. Yeah, Once I put that shit on, I'm sweating. Nigga, this shit, hey, I'm gonna tell you something too, nigga. When you're bald, ain't no hair to stop the sweat, nigga. That shit just run the fuck on down. Oh yeah. Nigga, I Man. wish y'all I wish y'all the best, and I can't wait till it happen to you two niggas. Man. That's so funny. I don't need that action, man. Oh, it's gonna happen to you too, nigga. Man, I'm telling hey, you. Hey, your pops. I've been got already woofing, wait, man. Did your pops got all his hair? Yeah, he still got his hair. Oh, you might be hey, like Everybody your pops got, got all his hair? Yep. Yeah. No, no, he don't. He, he, Woo, he got a bald head like you. <laughs> no, he got the mama side of the jeans. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> nigga, at one point, your mom shit gonna thin out a little bit. I'm yeah. gonna keep it 100, nigga. You doomed. It's going to happen. This is the most, he said, the most negative shit I've said. <laughs> he said, I had to break your spirit. Hey, you you know that for this. Like, you know. I had to break your spirit like, for you, leaders. Make sure you tell your barber don't take too much off the top. No. And just, this, matter of fact, go home and hug your pops hey. and tell him you feel the struggle. Him keep, you don't, but it's enough, coming. Keep enough on the top. And just keep that, keep this here, bro. Don't touch this. Just you in on the joke shit. too, nigga? Nah, nah. I'm, <laughs> I'm like, no, I'm you. Hey, they got some shit that I've been watching. Hey, hey, they got that little spray paint you can spray in that oh, motherfucker. No. This line motherfucker back. says spray hey. paint. <laughs> oh, yeah, the homies that did that for my little beard. For me, for me. Oh, yeah. That's nigga, they spray your beard on? Nah, just this one little patch. <laughs> this is one little patch. I can't fix it. It's these little hair bumps. Nigga, oh, yeah. you little patchy motherfucker. It was just the last three weeks. Oh, hell like, hey, no. Just spray me in real quick right here. Yeah, just spray me in. Hey, fill it in, nigga. Everything else is real. You feel me? You just that one spot. Nigga, nigga, fill me in today, nigga. Nigga, if you don't stop, nigga. You don't stop, nigga. That motherfucker's just... You're going to get the sweat and that shit going to run down your cheek. <laughs> I already got the sweat towel. You know I pat it. Pat. Hey. Nigga, fuck around and wipe that bitch smooth off. Like, oh. hey, you know I'm the same hey, size hey. as most women. And then let him wipe it the wrong way. Hey, oh, that shit. nigga going to be at dinner and shit. And that nigga going to go to wipe that bitch. They going to be like, you need to go to the bathroom right quick. What's, what, what, what's wrong with your face? Hey, hey. I, I don't have enough there to catch no food, so hey. I'm good. I just wipe it. Take this mascara and go fix that shit. <laughs> Hey, I'm on you, man. I'm an actor, you feel me? I got to be ready at all times. Look right. Look oh, proper. Man. Oh, man. We just fucking with you, bro. Hey, we oh, love you man. here, man. Yeah, hey, I love it, man. At any time, you can come and you can sit in, get on, or whatever, Get on, bro. talk our shit, you feel me? That part. Oh, and man. like I said, bro. Conversation. Love it. As soon as you're ready, we want to invite you to come in and do a little stand-up. And let's have some fun, bro. All right, let's go. Come on, man. Hey, I can man. make y'all laugh. I can make anybody laugh. You feel me? Nah, we stupid, though. Why would you use that word? Because we are. <laughs> uh, what you want us to say? We're enlightened. Hey. We Nigga, powerful. fuck that. We stupid. No, we got to go. That's uh, going down. Well, if he's stupid, I'm retarded. Okay, that's <laughs> the fuck I'm talking about. Crazy. I'm that's what I'm talking I'm about. I'm just mentally fucked up. <laughs> Any of the clean shit, say that for another show, nigga. When you in here, nigga, like, hey, shit. Oh, let all that shit go? Let it go. Nah, the family be watching everything I do, so hey. I got to So they it. already know, nigga. Why is you sugarcoating it? They all know. Right. 
Then stop watching my shit, family, so goddamn much so I can be myself. Everybody saying the funny and always saying this and that. Keep your opinions to yourself and let me be me. Because guess what? You got to be bold. You got to be courageous to try new things. If not, you're going to be stationary. You're going to be doing the same shit. Definitely you're not going to be world, evolving. Man. You feel me? So you got to evolve. You feel me? We was grandfather in not to evolve. So make sure you evolve as a human, as, as a person, intellectually. And on oh, that man. note, message. Lessons. We, we, we out of this motherfucker, man. No, it's your boy no, Big Ski. No. What? What? I didn't, we didn't hear no gripe. Yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah, I ain't what got you, no gripe, man. Just trying to get on enough, yeah, enough for. Yes. It's on Everybody you. Everybody speak. What's y'all gripe? It's on you. Oh, shit. Yeah. Man, I always got a gripe. Hey. <laughs> he like that shit. Great was that burp right there. <laughs> I mean, shit. <laughs> hey, you know what, man? I like hey. that. Hey, life is great for me right now. Come on. Because I didn't have no kids this weekend. My gripe of the week is going to be shit. Going to pick they little asses up in a little bit and have to get back to my daddy shit. That mean I can't fuck the way I want to, god damn it. God damn. Keep it 100. But on that note, man, it's your boy Big Ski. That's your boy Dusty Joe. Your boy Crazy Neil Ray. Your boy Neil Ray. We here, man. Hey, yes, man. Y'all keep tapping in with us. Hey, man. we got the uh, the podcast coming up at 3 o'clock on the Big Ski Radio. We also got the Dusty Joe kickback hour at 5 o'clock. And we also got the Latin hip hop at 7. Hey, man. Thank y'all for hanging out with us. Y'all enjoy y'all Sunday. We out. Yes, sir. Peace. One love.